A photo from the happiest of times, their wedding less than 18 months ago. Now heartbreak for the family of Diane and Ron Hughes. This, the wreckage of the helicopter they died in as it was taking off from a sandbank. Somehow, in good weather and visibility, it collided with another tourist helicopter that was coming into land. Alongside the British couple and an Australian passenger, the pilot, Ash Jenkinson, was killed. Big guy with a big heart, a true legend. I'd spent a lot of time in that helicopter with Ash on numerous occasions, but, yeah, he was, he was, a, he was a very good pilot. Um, so for something like yesterday to happen sort of blows your mind a bit. The helicopter Diane and Ron were in fell upside down with its rotor blades torn off by the collision. Miraculously, the other helicopter landed safely with only minor injuries on board. The second helicopter coming in to land, now that has remarkably managed to land upright and considering the damage that was done to the front left-hand section of that helicopter where the pilot was sitting, that's been a, a remarkable achievement. As news spread back to the UK, locals in the Cheshire town of Neston paid tribute to Ron Hughes, a well-known figure who's run a shop here on the high street for 30 years. I was so shocked, because I heard that his, his wife as well, you know. Then you got married sad. in 2021. I know, yeah. So sad. He was a great bloke. Everybody liked him. Very pleasant, always spoke when you were going past. He's been um, a shopkeeper for many years and uh, very well respected in the community. And, uh, yeah, people will. I'll miss him. Diane and Ron were in Australia visiting his daughter Jane, who issued a statement saying, our family is heartbroken. Three other passengers from their helicopter remain in hospital in a critical condition. Peter Lane, Five News.